what's going on guys today i have a very special build to present to you it is called cody flicks cody flicks is one of the best builds i've seen so far it is based off of netflix it has all the top add-ons integrated into it it has the top movies top tv shows it's very easy to navigate through so let me show you a very brief overview of cody flicks and then i'm going to show you how to install it so that you can put it right onto your system today all right, so the first thing we see right here, this is the trending reel like there is in Netflix. You can see that the Revenant's on here, the big short. And if we keep going, we can see all the other movies that are trending. If we go down, we have my movies. Underneath that, we have the top rating movies right now. And you could choose one of these movies. And it'll open automatically. All right, if we keep going down, we can see what the current movies are for the year. There's screeners, and there's a whole bunch of other things down here on current movies. If you keep going down, you have the HD releases, so they have all the Star Wars movies. Any movies that they have in HD will be right here. As you go down, you have the 2015 HD movies. If you go down a little bit more, you have the cartoons. So if, let's say, you want to watch Aladdin... You get to pick a link, and it plays directly for you. And then we're going to keep going down. You got my TV shows. You have the trending TV shows. You have the TNPB TV shows. You have Her Place TV shows. You have Phoenix's latest episodes. You have Genesis Most Popular. There's TV, which you could choose between the most popular, last added, newest episodes. And underneath that, you have the one-channel TV shows. And then we have our collections, which basically shows you the disclaimer and ways for you to get help. If we keep going down, we have Phoenix. Underneath that, we have UK Turks Playlist for their live TV. And underneath that, we do have More Power, which has different types of movies and TV shows. So if you keep going, you can see there's a Disaster Disease movies. You have James Bond movies, Futuristic movies superhero movies, 80s movies. All right, and if we keep going down, we do have our video add-ons. So all our video add-ons will be here. So if you want to use i4a TV for your live TV, if you want to use Sports Devil, everything will be right here. So before we do put this build on our platform, if you do press the left button, in this menu you can choose directly which category you want. You could also see your video files. You can click Live TV. There's a Sports Kids. There's an add-on installer. All the add-ons are here, and your settings is here as well. Without any further ado, let me show you how to put this build on our platform. All right, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go all the way to System, File Manager, Add Source. We're going to type in HTTP, Just New Tech, dot com, slash schism. We can name it schism. We're going to go back. To make this easier for you guys, I will put the repo URL down in the description down below, okay? So then we're going to go back. We're going to go to Settings, Add-ons, Install from Zip. We're going to find the Schism. And we are going to install the Schism TV add-ons. Our next step is to install from Repository. We're going to go to Schism TV Repositories. We're going to go to Program Add-ons. And we're going to install the Schism TV wizard. Once the Schism TV wizard is installed, we will click on it and we will click launch. We will then click unlock build. Once the build is unlocked, we will need to force close Cody and restart it. So I'll be right back. All right, now we can go back to Programs, Schism TV Wizard, and we can click Schism TV Builds. We can then install our Schism TV Cody Flicks. This process does take a while, so I will fast forward this part till the end. All right, right after it's all done installing, we will have to force close Cody. So you will have to say yes, close, and Cody should close from there. This is the best way to get it to install properly. 
As Cody is reopening, you can see the new Cody Flex. And over here, you can see Master User. If you click on the Master User, you will see that you have to enter in a master lock code. I will also be putting this master lock code in the description down below, but the master lock code is 20160402. And then we're going to press enter. In this screen, we are going to let it load and let it cache. That's the best way to get this to work perfectly. Once it's all done loading and caching, you can see that this is working perfectly. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy this video, please give this video a big thumbs up. Share it with your friends. And subscribe to this channel to get more on Cody. Till next time, guys.